Hey guys, hope you're all doing well and welcome back. Let's play some more Europa Universalis 4 as the Ruskis. So, uh, Norway is, uh, they're broke. Like, straight up, they're just broke and they're not going to be able to field an army. It's kind of a bummer, but they are contributing manpower to me. So, that's pretty good, I suppose. Or they're contributing force limit. I don't know if there's a way to actually check that. I'm sure there is. I'm sure Roomba's explained it multiple times. Okay, here we go. So, Norway's giving me four force limit, which, you know, it's pretty good. I mean, I'm not even close to that. Yeah, I'm up to 50, 85 force limit. So, I mean, granted, all this is going to be super rebellious, and I'm going to have rebels over here. So, it's uh, just something that we're going to have to worry about in time. Uh, we'll marry both of you guys. Yeah, sure. I think we need to annex perm. It will take... Five years, so let's do it. Because uh, when we form Russia, we are going to certainly need to... Um, what do we need to do this? Oh, we have to own Smolensk? Okay, so we'll be able to form them whenever we finish up coring Smolensk, actually. So, form the Russian Empire. So, this may be the episode we do it, which is pretty cool. Um, so, let's get you guys and you guys... Let's actually just get them all joined up in Smolensk here. Um, let's actually have you guys sit there for a minute so you're not taking attrition for no reason. Um, let's see, build that there. Mm. Yeah, we'll use some, a little more manpower. I know I've said that I don't think manpower will be an issue when we form Russia, which it probably won't, but... Still, whatever. We'll do it. It's no big deal. Um, so let's get you guys all joined up over here. Get you guys split and over there. So we're also going to build a couple more cannons because why not? Um, force limit is really low. Does it go up? Damn. Okay. Well, that's fine. Um, it's because it's the winter. You know, I think we're just going to suck it up and deal with it, and hopefully it's not an issue. Um, so let's get you guys all... ...that. Since we have our army turned off, it will literally accomplish nothing, but that's okay. Um, let's have you guys putting down these rebels. And there we go. And core up that, and we should be able to form Russia here in a couple of seconds. Which is pretty dope. South Karelia. So that's over here, I believe. White Ruthenia, Smolensk. Where's Karelia? Yeah, it's right here. Um, I think we do it. It'll increase our... And we'll just full core it as we can. Because we really... Um, we need to make sure that we are... Um, getting our... What's the word I'm looking for? Idea set. Or religious ideas. Speaking of that, are clicks ready? No. When will they be? 27. So, in a couple of years. Very good. Smolensk is now considered part of the fold. Alright. Enact Sardom. Um, yeah, let's do it. Yes, please. We are the Ruskies. Mother Russia. We will, uh, you know, for the, for the motherland and all that. Make St. Petersburg the capital? I'm not so sure about. I do like Moskva. It is free six base tax. Lots of money to be spent, though. Huh. I'm not sure. We'll hold on to that for later. Is there, um... Yeah. So we can, we can worry about that later. Kazani's separatist, so it looks like we need to turn up the army maintenance a bit. Will that turn down the rebels? It will not. So we got a bunch of... Oh my goodness, we got claims on all of this? Goodness gracious. Okay. Well, um, Kazani separatists... I'm assuming it's just these provinces over here. Hmm. Guess we're just waiting until next year? Probably war exhaustion. 
Yeah, because next year, at the yearly tick. There we go. All right. And we're at a positive now. We are now making money. A decent amount, actually. We actually took, um, two, um, forts from them, which is really good for us, because look at that zone of control. Let me see here. Yeah. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, zone of control is really good. Fort, fort, fort. I mean, honestly, we can get rid of a couple of these, probably, because we don't need all of them, so we'll get rid of that one. We got these forts. Building a row here. Latgalia has one as well, so we're good. Let's switch that one over. Honestly, I probably don't need to because once I get um, once I get um, religious ideas taken care of, oh, they are taking a bit of attrition there. Eh, it's fine. Not sure. All right, so let's see here. Bohemia. Let's improve those relations with you. All of you guys are good. Your debt is so, so juicy. <laughs> um, Perm is having rebels issues, so they're not going to be getting taken care of there. So let's uh, turn up that army maintenance. Put our... Oh, he is a trash. Hold on. There we go. We actually just went over, went up, there we go. May refill the garrison, very cool. All right. Polotsk. Uh, I have no claims on you. He's allied to Bohemia. Hmm. That's a bummer. Well, I'll eventually do it. I just don't want to have to go to war with Bohemia for it. It's whatever. All right. Conquest against Zaforzi. Oh, there you go. Um, is our truce with you up yet? Fifteen twenty-six. So very close. We have plenty of claims on you now. We'll take all of it. We may even vassalize Ostrakhan. Oh, he's allied to the Ottoman. Hmm. Maybe we should ally Georgia or ally somebody to prevent the Ottomans from expanding. Have we rivaled them? We have not. I wonder, and we can't? Seems a bit strange to me. Okay, whatever. Uh, Great Horde can hate me as much as they. Please, it does not bother me at all. Um, May. So let's get you guys down here. You guys will continue to um, put down those rebels. So let's get you over there. Okay, so our truce is up. Uzbek and Biapas. Biapas down here. Uzbek is right here. Don't care about either of them. Um, let's go with... Do you have any... Saratov, so let's get that one. Very good. Let's actually take down these rebels. Very good. Integration is a slow process, and Russia grows larger yet. Can I do the Siberian frontier? I can, and we're gonna do it. Oh, that's a wasteland. Okay, cool. Um, so Uzbek kind of just has free reign on my men now, so or on my land, so I should probably get them moving over that way. Uh, missionaries to reduce yearly corruption. Sure. We have full army maintenance, and we're sitting at 12 ducats a month income balance. So that's really good. Uh, we're gonna take out their capital here. Very good. So let's get you guys down here and get you guys over here. Get you guys over here to take out Uzbek. Just kick them out of the war, honestly, is what I want to do. 
Gains a claim on the Ural region. Very cool. Free claims on Uzbek. Honestly, I might take some land from them. Uh, so do we need more Patriarch Authority? Matter of fact. Mm. Legitimacy we're good on. National Unrest would be pretty nice. But I don't think it's worth it. Um, improved relations, construction costs, manpower. Let's just do this. Manpower recovery speed for, I think it's 20 years, right? Yeah. So that'll be useful. Let's just go with it. Just roll with it. And uh, get this all siege down over here. Okay, and they can siege down this stuff all they want. It's not going to affect me in the slightest. Because at the end of the day, I'm still just going to carpet siege them down. Very good. Alright, so Uzbek, you are going to give me these two provinces that I have claims on. You will do it, and you have no say in it. Do they have any forts over here? Not any to speak of. They're just randomly sieging down the Borg over here. All right, so we can do our clicks, but we are done with that. So let's take a couple of points into manpower. Very good. Wait, the monthly tick. Great Horde Separatists and Rise On. Let's get you guys on there. Very good. Let's take that tech. What are we looking for with idea cost? Stab cost. Integrate perm for diplo points. Okay. So Uzbek will give me that. I have literally no say at all. You are coming over here. And you are coming over there. And you are coming down here. They're probably going to get that siege up here so that's kind of a bummer half off level two admin advisor i will certainly take you matter of fact and give you a level three because uh dimitri is getting old so our next guy is actually gonna dimitri the second was actually is gonna be super good he's even got idea costs so we'll wait for that all right so uzbek you really just gotta give it up, brother. Let's get you guys over there and get you guys down here. And then get you guys over here, over here, and over there. Support the Cossacks or the Burgers? Oh. We have not had loyal Burgers basically this whole game. So let's do that and then support the Burgers is fine. Defender of the Faith. I'm good with not doing that for now. They can siege this stuff down all they want. It's not really a big deal. Let's get those men off that, though. All right. So Biapas does one out. Now we'll just white piece them. You will now give me all of your money. Well, at least war reps in the two provinces that I asked for. I will core that up. I will get that army over here. Up here. Get you guys all joined up. Let's see what we have claims on. We'll take basically all of it. A hundred as aggressive expansion. <laughs> okay. Um, it's going to cost 156 admin. Whatever. Let's do it. We are rush after all, so let's go sort by overextension, core all this up. Very good. And get all you guys over here into the steps. Uh, it's fine. Dangerously aggress overextended. All right. Just picked up like ton of dev at one time so that's pretty cool we can send you guys up here honestly I should have taken a little more 
but that's fine. Because I don't think those colonies cost anything, right? They're free. Are they? Yeah, colonial maintenance, so they're free. Very cool. So let's get you guys... Let's actually have you guys all come over here. You are going... Oh my gosh. I wonder if we're going to have any uprisings over here. So let's get you guys to put down these ones over here in perm. Okay, naval supplies. Very cool. Um, Muscovite Kazani Separatists. So these are all guys I'm not worried about. Just gonna wait on the tech cost to go down a bit. Okay. That's fine. And they're on a fort, so that's good for us. Let's get, make sure you're a good one. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's pretty bad, actually. That's a lot of enemies. But, I mean, honestly, we expect it, so it's not a big deal. Let him... Very good. And let's just have you protect over here, because they're they're gonna revolt sooner or later. Um, let's wait until next year for you. Provincial unrest is still pretty high. Speed, five in it. Still losing a little bit of money because of the, uh... You're gonna... Oh, you're avoiding strong, ar strong armies. Hmm. That's weird. Could've sworn you have multiple thousands more than him. Uh... I don't care about the government reform progress. Just please finish up that guy. He had... He must have... Our leader must have died. Because we had no leader on that army, which is kind of annoying. Ugh. So many enemies. There we go. Let's get a general over there and get you leveled up, which will help with our income. Back to negative income. Feels so bad, man. Let's get you guys. There you go. That actually may be all of them for now. No, there's going to be a couple more uprisings, but that's fine. Have you guys over here. So the Danes will... Ooh, they're allied to France and Hungary. Okay, so the Danes actually have done something for themselves. Hmm. Could declare war on Crimea. Lithuania, which would allow us to just completely kick them in a little more. Ostrakhan, who's allied to the Ottomans. Would they join? Yeah, they would. Mm, not sure. Not sure. 10 Patriarch Authority. Jeez. That's really good. Alright, well, if that's the case, and we'll go Defender of the Faith. Why not? Get this stuff all converted up. Take the stab costs. Why not? Make our way up there. That missionary strength is going to be really helpful. Matter of fact, let's just turn that army off. Turn the armies off for a couple of months and really build up some of that income. Smolenskian separatists. Ah, oh, you sons of guns. Alright, so let's get you guys joined up. Have you guys split and come down here? Let's just start adding some of this stuff because that'll help with income as well. Very good. Just get that money. Money, money, money. So I wonder if we could actually knowledge share with anybody. City of Montgomery, Gildum. Oh, we'll improve relations with you just in case. 
When's our truce up with you? 36. One more month and we can finish up that coring. Ugh, this is an annoying one. Whatever. I need to actually do these clicks anyways. I'm actually not going to do the clicks for you, but I will do them for the rest of you. Oh, hit the wrong button. Damn. Okay. Well, <laughs> I didn't really need the bullet points anyways, so it's kind of annoying, but it is what it is. And we'll take that. And then... Conquistador. Interesting. Um, I think we're good without you. So our colonies are all coming along pretty well. So we're kind of waiting on this one, honestly. Uzbek is uh, putting a bit of a damper on our stuff. So these mountains over here, so these must be the Ural Mountains, I assume. Kind of like down through this area. Rebel Uprising in Nogay. Truce with Biapas is expired. So it must be these guys. Looks like he's crossing over. Son of a gun. Go, 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 go. Suppress the rebels. Uh, Grand Captain is dead. Let's go with um, only 20% fort defense? I was thinking it was 33. Maybe I'm thinking of the defensive edict. Um, sure, that's fine. I don't really care. Very good. So I actually can colonize both of these after this one's done. After this one's done specifically, I'll be able to get any of this. Uh, cool. Free prestige, I'll take it. <clears throat> one more there. Very good. So that means we can do that one. Make our font a little bit bigger. Level 3 stab cost modifier. Level 1 prestige for half cost. I'll go with that one because I can just upgrade him. And the prestige is really nice. Oh, the unrest is pretty nice as well. Wait, was he cheaper? Damn, okay, I'm just sticking with him. Spend some money for no reason. Like a dingus. Okay, so... How... Do we have a... We do not... If you would die, that would be super cool, man. All right, that'll do it for this episode. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, show some support and leave a like on the video because it really helps me out. We want to make Russia as strong as possible. We're going to reform the uh, classical borders, and we are going to expand all the way down into here, eat up all of this. And anything past that, we are going to make into vassals like Norway. For example, we're going to feed him Sweden and maybe Denmark once, uh, you know, we can do that right so it'll be tough but anyways if you guys want to see more of this you can subscribe to the channel ding the little bell icon it'll send you a notification every time i upload which is the best way to keep up to date on the channel but with all that being said this is chewy shoot and i'll catch you guys later